Hey everybody, we are back with another review and today we got some pickups from Target. So without further ado, let's hop right into this review and let's see what we got in the boxes from Target. Let's do the smaller one. We'll go small, medium, large. So these are the inside boxes, the double boxes, which is nice that Target does this. I ain't gonna worry about covering up labels or having an ugly box on the table. But we also have to be careful that we make sure that we don't cut too deep in there. Nice, we got a Japanese Wolverine. Very cool. Nice. This is when he went against the Silver Samurai. That over there in the corner. Let's see what we got in this one. Nice. It's been about a, two years since I've seen this new and sealed. Let's pull this out. Wow. Pretty cool. 2018. Almost three years. That's pretty wild. It's pretty wild. Nostalgia. Um, I'm going to open it and then we'll get into the big box. Nostalgia. Now this is a, a very interesting box. It's a, where are we getting here? Get the film? It's a very interesting box because this comes with something that you could get some good value out of. They have these trading cards in here. And a lot of people might not know, but some of them are worth some money. And now Funko is releasing their own trading cards. So I'm sure these would be worth some money. We got Batman Bombshell Pop. Black Canary, the notepad, and the enamel pen. Pop it open and see. There we go. All right, right on top. Gotham or bust pin. These are the trading cards we were talking about. Eh, I don't want to rip the card, so I'm going to do it like that. I don't want to tear across the top and bend the card. Let's see what we got. No foils, but we did get some cool cards. We ended up getting Batgirl, Batwoman. Woo, we got a Harley Quinn. That's cool. Poison Ivy and a Wonder Woman. I think I know someone who might like this Harley Quinn. Put that aside right there. All right, cool. Uh, I do have a foil Batgirl in one of my other boxes that I popped of these. Because I used to buy a ton of these when they were in the store on clearance just to pop the packs so here we go we got dc comics bombshells this is a wonder woman notebook just some kind of collectibles to have in here as packing items which is nice and these rock candies are actually really cool this black canary one is like gorgeously sculpted check that out she's got her own microphone stand very dope target exclusive rock candy on that there's the black canary bombshell very cool, and that will put her next to Wolverine over here. Now let's bust out the Batman figure and see what we got in the box. So here is a DC Comics Bombshells Batman. Very cool. This is him in his trench coat. Here's the line. He, Him and the Joker are the only two men in this line. The Joker has a bunch of kisses all over him, and then this is the Batman version for it. So we got, actually I'm gonna put him up here for now just so he doesn't get damaged. Next up we got is we got a box that says do not cut. So we're gonna cut it. We're gonna cut it. We're gonna cut it. Let me cut. cut over, always cut over to the side is what I like to do. Cause it still breaks it. See how it still breaks it? Let me see if I can move this back. See how it's, I cut over to the side? See how it still breaks the tape? But you're not actually cutting down the down the main seam, I cut like just an offset from the box. So I'm cutting into the box, not into what's inside the box. I mean, you gotta be tactful when you're when you're collecting for sure. Oh, interesting. I haven't seen one of these in three years either. Check that out. We got the Caddyshack box with that flocked gopher. Awesome. Pop that off. This is a pretty cool box, actually, because it has a really awesome hat in there, which I'm actually wearing right now. So, 
I wear it actually in all my videos. And I've been wearing it in my videos for just about two years now, actually. So here we go. Actually, since I, I literally bought this, I've been wearing this hat in my videos, so pretty cool. Nice, and I got a nice fresh one for the collection. It's always nice to have a nice fresh Bushwood Country Club hat. So that is actually one of the only things in this haul that I'll actually be keeping. Here is that beautiful flocked gopher. Gorgeous, gorgeous gopher. I think I have that gopher right here. Here it is, I have that gopher right here. It's one of my favorite pops in the collection. Dig that gopher, right? Definitely really cool. Love the, love the gopher flock. This was one of my first flocked pops that I got. I believe it was either this one or the flocked blue bear from the tailspin line. I'm not sure which one it was, but I got them both at Target, so. Very cool. Flocked gopher. Awesome. That is awesome. All right, let me know down in the comments below what was your favorite from this pickup. Was it the Bushwood Country Club gopher and hat? Was it some of the bombshell stuff? Or was it the Wolverine from... Uh, Silver Samurai vs. Wolverine in Japan. Let me know down in the comments below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Want more content like this? Subscribe for more because I do reviews every single day. So look for that and have a great rest of your day.